Holy smokes! From the mountains high above Hollywood, California, it's the Surfing Monkey Show with your host, me, David Urey. And me, Thomas Rounds. Ha, hey, everybody. Hey, how's it going, everybody? <laughs> We're having a rootin' tootin' time. We are having a rootin' tootin' time. How you doing today, David? It's uh, good to see you. It's good to see you, too. You have an audition later today, right? I do. I'm auditioning for a children's movie. Uh, to play a wholesome mailman. That's wow. why I shave my beard. Oh, I shave my you beard look wholesome. for it. I like to think that I can go from convicted pedophile to wholesome mailman in just <laughs> about two and a half minutes. I don't know, but I mean, it's great that you think you can do that. <laughs> I think that's awesome. I also was in a very wholesome, I had an audition yesterday. Uh, not that you asked. Did you have any auditions lately, Thomas? <laughs> not really. Oh, I guess I had one yesterday as an elf for a popular department store. Yeah. So that's why I shaved some of my beard off as well. So really, acting is all about adapting your facial hair to the role. That's <laughs> what it comes down to. And they're just, the casting people, the producers, they're always looking for that perfect, that perfect facial, facial hair. hair for the role. And that's role. why Thomas and I have created the only facial hair class in Los Angeles, New York, Chicago, London, and... Uh, Auckland. Yes, Auckland we just <laughs> added. We just added Auckland. So that's why we're not even sure if we're pronouncing it right, right. yet. No, it's, it's so Auckland. New. It is? Okay. Yeah. Um, Awkward. <laughs> <laughs> what was your first audition? Um, it was for the gong show. The Chuck the, Barrett's. Really? The yeah, gong show? Back in the 70s. I was 15 years old. I thought I was such an amazing frisbee spinner. Yeah. And, uh, and were you? I got all the way down here and realized I hadn't picked out music. Or a frisbee. Or a, no, I had my frisbee. I was using the 165. Oh, yeah, that's a great one the, for the spinning. Whammo. Yeah. Sure, um, the Whammo 165. So I was looking through a National Geographic, and uh, I had one of those plasticky little records of humpback oh, yeah, yeah, whale yeah. sounds. I remember that. Humpback yeah. whales. Yeah. I thought, wow. They won't shut up. That's a perfect background for spinning a frisbee, I thought. Some yeah, meat, humpback some whales sound. spinning yeah. frisbee. Makes total Incredible. sense. <laughs> it's like... Meow. You yeah, know, thinking, no, of course. I was just imagining, picturing it in my head. It makes total sense. I got down there and I sat in the scummy looking little audition room. I walked in there and I handed them this little plastic record and they said, what side? And I go, I, I don't know. I, I hadn't listened to it. I just go, whatever side. You hadn't even listened to it <laughs> yet. No, I hadn't listened to it. So I start spinning uh, and I'm like going like this and I hear, the humpback whale is found in the northern <laughs> coastal waters of Northern California. <laughs> Three months later, when I didn't hear from them, you started to think. I called them on the phone <laughs> and was put on hold for like an hour before someone and, came. And on then you and, were like, "I don't understand what's happened. I had the whale music. I had the 165. <laughs> I was nailing it." Thomas Rowe. So, what made you want to become an actor? Um. Working with a group of people to tell a story, like being being in an ensemble to right. tell a story is, is really, it's it's awesome, it's very exciting. Like, is that the same for you or? Uh, yeah, I just really love me. And I just, I just wanted to give the world a chance to see this out of fairness. This, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, better on TV than on the streets. Exactly. Monkey. Hey, thanks for joining us. I'm Thomas Rounds. I'm David Yuri. And this is the Surfing Monkey Show. And we'll see you back here next week. Bye bye. Thanks. Thomas Rounds, David Yuri, Surfing Monkey Show. You just might learn something about yourself, but on second thought, I really don't think so. David Yuri, Thomas Rounds, and the Surfing Monkey, too. Just a little something on the internet that we put together for you.